Hey guys, this is Shiny Zachrob, and welcome back to another part of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. In the last part, we went through Thunder Wave Cave to help a Magnemite become... Or I should say, save a couple Magnemite buddies. So, they wouldn't... So they'd be able to form a Magneton, as well as the fact that... We saved some other Pokemon through some rescue missions. This time, we have to go save Diglett, who has been abducted by Skarmory in Mount Steel. Last time, we also finished up the preparations for it, so let's get going right into Mount Steel. So this is it. Mount Steel. Diglett's been taken to the peak here. That's right. The peak is Nina. Thank you for helping. Farewell. Well, I guess we go. Alright. Let's make our climb through Mount Steel. And go save that Diglett. Feed some Pokemon. We had to move away because we were in danger. Alrighty. We got our first orb here, but. We got some Pokemon to fight first. Ooh, nice critical hit. And up here. Here's our stairs. Oop. Air on here, who we can't really damage. Neither me or Totodile. Oop. There we go. Get some money. Let's get rid of the Spiro. Get rid of that Spiro. And Totodile hits level 9. And there's our stairs. I did it again. There we go. Wonder if this bouncer will be it. Because we. Totodile was about 570 away the last I remember. We were 750. And yep, there it is. Level 11. And no Ember yet. Sad. We're running very low on Tackle PP. We might have to have Totodile fight for us soon. But since we found it, let's take the stairs. Nice crit. Find some more money. Ooh, a gummy. The first instance of a gummy, too. Thank goodness. Uh, I say, let us ourselves eat it. And we get PP pee -pee Checker. Even though it's not going to be useful until very late. Get another crit. Wow. We are crit masters right now. Alright, let's hit 5 up. Oh, 
Is Lear uh, thank you, Toto, for using Scratch. Another layer, ooh. Uh, you need to kill that thing. Thank you. Oh, let me just lower your attack. You're gonna have to use that orange berry we just found. There. All right, let's move on. And we get searing change with some more money. Oh, and we just ran out of attack off. Oops. And we're gonna have to be very careful when proceeding on from now on. Actually, I have one choice I have to do here. Thank goodness we stored some. HP up 4, attack 3, defense 2, special attack 1, special defense 2. Still no water gun or ember is what I really could use right now, but... Care if we get full EXP at this point. Oh boy. Ugh. Man, we we're blowing through our Warren Berries. Because I can't get another move by level up right now. I'm 177 away. Oh no, we wasted our Reviver Seed already. Oh my goodness. 
This run is not going well at all. Like, we may have to actually resort to using these right now. And we missed one. Really? Game, I don't need that right now. Toyota, I need you to kill this thing, not just let it... Oh my god, thank you. Thankfully we have our stairs over here. Alright, 8F, one more floor. Let's hope we can make it through. Thank you. And we got a level. And we finally got Ember. Thank you. I was scared we were not going to get it. Oh. It honestly did scare me. But we have to go through this battle without using pretty much anything. Because we don't have an Orenberry or Reviver Seed anymore. Oh, brown gummy. Orange, I mean, I guess. We'll give it to Toto Dial. I'll have him use it. And he gets PP Checker. That is what we need. And I guess while we're at the stairs, we'll play a couple more things. Thankfully, our Reviver Seed also gave us PP back for everything. And we have one Orenberry. Let's head into the fight. Look, Blaze Diglett's over there. Hey, are you all right? We're here to rescue you. I, I'm scared. You, what do you think you're doing here? We came to rescue Diglett. Hey, Skarmory, quit doing this and release Diglett. How dare you? It's their fault. I haven't slept in days because the earthquakes frightened me so. Every night we had them. Those earthquakes are caused by the brats' ilk running wild around underground. Whoa, that's not true. Sure, there have been quakes galore lately, but it would take more than Diglett's family running wild under the ground to set off a quake. You be quiet. We'll fight if you keep that up. It's useless. Skarmory is too seem to talk reasonably. We're going to have to fight. All right, and our fight with Skarmory begins. What we are going to do is throw a Growl Rock to do some damage. Then what we're going to do is Smoke Screen. What becomes a Whiffer. And we're going to Ember. And we got rid of Skarmory, nice. Grr, I can't keep up. I'll flee for now. Hey, we said Skarmory packing. You're safe now. Come on down. I, I can't. I'm too scared to move. Okay, no sweat. We'll go to you. Just wait. Whoa. Whoa. This is some cliff. I can't see the bottom. Please, what do we do? We can't get across this. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Hey, it's those Magnemites from the rescue. We got word of this. We can rescue Diglett from this guy. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Hold on to us tight. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Don't be scared. We will make the stake of zapping you. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Ow, I was very scared. Maybe because I was somewhere up so high. My feet feel like they're still walking on air. Feet? He has them? Feet? Oh well, you're safe now. Good thing, huh? Yes, thank you very much. Oh, you've been rescued. Great, great. Huh? What was that? Who said that? Whoops, you can't see us. That's terribly rude of us. Hello, Dogtrio here. Oh, Papa! Diglett, you had us worried. You're not hurt? Nope, it was scary, but I'm alright. It's all thanks to Blaze's team. Thank you for everything. You are heroes. I want to thank anyone. Thank our Magna, my friends. We couldn't have done this rescue on our own, right? Oh, how rude of us. Thank you so much. No, no, it was the only the only thing to do, and how both our evolved forms are joint trios, I felt a certain kinship. After all, Pokemon must help each other. I'm impressed. Sincerely, thank you. We must be going, Blaze. Gatorade. Thank you. Farewell. 
we get 500 polka dollars, a Petra scarf, and ginseng. We'll be on our way to. Excuse me. Whew. Wait a sec. Hold on. What is it? Listen. Um, how would you like to join us? Join your team? Yes. We could have done the last job if you weren't around, Magnum. Right? I thought we need more help for doing rescues in the future. Hey, Blaze, you think so too, right? Yes, more members needed. So come on, how about it? Join our rescue team. What do you say? Rescue team? That sounds fun. Bzz, bzz, bzz. But if you need us to rush over to rescue, we need somewhere to live close by. Is there anything where we can live in this area? Um, well, oh, there isn't. Too bad. Sorry, but we can't join you. See you. Bzz, bzz, bzz. That is too bad. I guess we need somewhere Pokemon can live if we want them to join the rescue team. I know. Let's go out to Pokemon Square tomorrow. There's this interesting shop called the Wigglytuff Club. It wasn't open the other day when we went to the square. It might be open tomorrow, though. The shop is next to Felicity Bank. Usually Wigglytuff is there. We might be able to get some useful information there. Alright, so that's what we'll do tomorrow. We'll go down to Pokemon Square. Saving. Nope. And we get another Eerie Knight. Again. It's that dream again. That Pokemon. Who could it be? Huh? I'm hearing better this time. What? Human? My role? But wait, please tell me more. I can't drifting off. The next morning. Morning, Blaze. Ah, ha, ha. what's with the dazed and confused look? You look half asleep. Huh? You've been having weird dreams. What sort of weird dreams? Blaze told Gator about the dream. Hmm, uh-huh. Blaze, you said you're really a human, right? So I was thinking, maybe those dreams have something to do with how you became a Pokemon? Let me ask you, Blaze, what are you thinking? Do you want to go back to being a human? It's true. I haven't thought about it much, but do I want to become a human again? I'm not sure. Huh, what's wrong? You can't decide? Well, I guess so. It's a lot more fun hanging around with me. Anyway, I promised we'd go to Pokemon Square today. Remember? We're supposed to go ask about how we can add members to our team. Let's roll already. Friends are my treasures. Welcome to Wigglytuff Club, a circle of friends. Oh, is this your first visit here? Oh, I get it. You started a rescue team too, didn't you? You've come to the right place. I sell friend areas to add members to your rescue team. Since you're here for the very first time, I'll give you two friend areas for free. Let's do it. Look at this up, look at this up, let's read friends. Ha! Congratulations, you can now go to the Wild Plains now. You can also go to the Mist Rise Forest. Now you can recruit Pokemon that live in these two friend areas. How do you recruit new members? Well, if you're fighting Pokemon that live in a friend area, sometimes they will come to admire you as a friend. In that case, they may ask to join your team. Just keep trying. Bzz, bzz, bzz. If you're giving friend areas away, can you also give my friends access to the Power Plant friend area? I also want to join their rescue team. Okay, gotcha. I'm giving it away today. Wigglytuff, Wigglytuff. Let's be friends. Ta! Ah, congratulations. You can go to the power plant now. Yes, now I can join their team. Yay! Bzz, bzz, bzz. Sorry, I know my friend turned down your offer to join your rescue team yesterday. But after mulling it all over all last night, my friend developed an overwhelming desire to become your team member. I apologize, but could you allow my friend to join your team? Oh wow, don't forget, we were the ones that asked your friend to join us, so yes, that'd be awesome. Glad to have your friend on board. Alright, good on you. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Do your best and try not to hinder your rescue teammates. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Yeah, I'll do my best. Yay. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Magnemite became a team member. Let's give a nickname. I'll just give it a simple name. Magnet. I'll be resting up in the power plant flender. If you want me to tag one for rescue, come get me at the power plant. Okay. Bzz, bzz, bzz. You know your friend here is by taking the left path from the rescue team base. There's a sign on the path up to your rescue base so you shouldn't have any trouble. That's all the giveaways say. If you want my friend here is, you'll have to buy them now. Which we are gonna buy a couple. This is Felicity Bank. We'll take the money out that we have. Friends of my chosen, welcome to the Wigglytuff Club. We are going to buy, in specific, I believe it is 
Overgrown forest. And we now have that. Hmm. We're also going to grab Thunder Meadow while we're at it. And we'll save the rest of our money for now. Huh? What's going on over there? There seems to be a commotion. Please help my friend. Please. I need help. Forget it. We're not about to work for that. But my friend needs a gust of wind. Please. Hey, what's up? Huh? That scene there? Jump Club's begging for a rescue mission but not finding any luck. See that guy? There. The one in the middle with the pointy nose. Pinocchio? He's a Pokemon named Shiftry. He's got his own rescue team. But his team's greedy. They don't work unless they get paid royally. Jump Club's been begging for help, but I feel sorry for that poor Pokemon. Wait. Oh, uh, what do you want? Oh, it's Alakazam. That's Alakazam? Hey, rather cold-hearted, aren't you? To save Jump Club's friend, a strong wind is needed. Your leafy fans can whip up powerful winds. It's an easy matter for you. Help that Pokemon out. Grr, just, okay, we'll do it. Wow, that ship you agreed without any argument. Hey, who are those guys? What? You don't know? It's Alakazam's team. They're the most famous rescue team around these parts. That's Charizard. His flamethrower can melt mountains. That's Tyranitar. He takes great pride in his armored body and amazing strength. And that's the leader, Alakazam. Alakazam doesn't like physical attacks. He fights with his psychic powers. He's endowed with an amazing brain and an IQ of 5,000. Apparently, he's memorized everything that's happened in the world. Alakazam does all the commanding in the team. He's clearly in charge. Thank, thank you. No need for thanks. It is only natural that you get help. If anyone turns you down again, come see me. Take care. C cool. I wouldn't expect less from a gold rank rescue team. <gasps> what? What's wrong? What's up? It's fine. Nothing. Let's go. Woo, that was scary. Sheesh. Cool. Woo, Blaze. That's what we gotta become. Let's get more members and make our rescue team first class. Not if I can help it. Kick <laughs> it. The next morning. Good morning, Blaze. And we don't need that. All right. So this is going to be the uh, tail end of the episode. But what we're going to do is we're going to prepare up for a mission day. And sell this plain seed. And we'll sell this Petra scarf. And we'll sell this gravel rock. And what I want to do is buy that reviver seed. And then that Kangaskhan. We need to take out, take one orange berry out, and we'll take two out. Organize up our items. We'll store up the rest of our money. And we'll take a look at our jobs that we can do. Two tiny woods, three thunder wave caves, and two mount steels. 
Geodude, find the Geodude. I think we're going to take these three Thunderwave Caves. So we can get three jobs done in one. Alright. And I think that's just going to be about it. We saved Diglett from Skarmory in this episode, as well as we have unlocked Wigglytuff Club, and we can now buy friend areas. Which we got Mistrice Forest, Wild Plains, Power Plant, and we bought not only um, Thunder Meadow, but we have also bought Overgrown Forest. In the next part, we are going to set out to do some rescue jobs and get some more Explorer Points. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.